Hello, I'm Neil Forbes. The image you see here is of the Gulflander rail motor which runs from Normanton to Croydon in the outback Queensland, North Queensland. The image has been supplied with thanks by Tim of Tim's Video Channel 1. The information supplied by Queensland Rail has this as a tin hair. This is incorrect. This was never a tin hair rail motor. We will see a tin hair rail motor in a moment. The tin hair was actually an ex New South Wales Government Railways rail motor which operated in regional New South Wales from 1923 to the mid 1980s. And this is what a tin hair looks like. The CPH class rail motors, of which number seven is immediately apparent, was built in 1923 by the Government Railways and was first brought into service in 1923, which means that this year, just about to finish, was the 100th anniversary. Here's a look at the uh, view from the rail the driver's cabin as we approach a passing loop this gives an idea of what the tin hairs look like from inside number seven was actually built in 1924 more on that later These clips are taken from various videos that I have done. And here we have the three lined up together at Dungog Railway Station. Firstly, number one, which was surprisingly not the prototype. It was built slightly later. They consist of two passenger compartments and a centre luggage compartment with the driver's cabins right in the middle of each. And here's number three. This was indeed the prototype CPH class rail motor. And number seven, which as I said was built in 1924, so its 100th anniversary will come up next year in 2024 and a short view of Dungog Railway Station this video is to clear up some misconceptions made about the tin hair thank you for watching